Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of the new safe hour jumping again. Of course, in the last episode we lost our streak. It is sad, but it had to happen eventually. So this time, we're going to jump in as the lad himself, Tainted Jacob. I actually thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy this character, but they are very difficult. So it's just kind of a look of the draw for how you end up doing. So we'll see. We shall see. Uh, but I generally really, really like this character. Um, of course... We get Anima Solar and we can use it on normal enemies, at least until our BFF comes about. Um, our brother, our mischief maker. But I really like the fact that you can use him for some crazy good damage. Um, and yeah, he's, he's, he's a pretty pretty spicy guy. And I'm sure there'll be a swift death in here somewhere. We'll, we'll just have to see how it goes. But of course, we can do the whole shebang and kill everything, which is rather nice. Um, <clears throat> and we can do that on a lot of enemies. It's, it's real good. It's real good. But it's going to take me some time to get used to him, um, managing him and just sort of playing around him. So forgive me if I make some terrible mistakes to start out. But hopefully they won't last long and we'll be able to actually get some good stuff done. But I like doing stuff like this. You can just like make him walk into some really annoying enemies and deal with them very, very swiftly and very, very easily. Uh, we'll go do the boss straight away because it should be a fairly easy boss fight. I mean, look at the damage already there. Look at the damage. Now, this isn't a great boss fight here because we've got very little space to work with, but we managed to get him to go straight into her. Nice and easy. We get some eye drops, which I'm pretty darn happy with, actually. Uh, we've also got four bombs, so looking for secret room would not go amiss. Uh, as for the question of the day today, what's something that you've lost recently that you're upset about? Because for me, I have lost some Discord members. It is a big oof. Um... Just generally in my Discord, a few a few of the older members in my Discord left recently. And it's like, it's it's whatever. People people move on. It's fine. But it's also like sad times. Sad times. I like those people. And they're just gone. They're just gone. Uh, speaking of which, if you aren't in my Discord already, I'd definitely like to have you in there. I'd like... I, I generally am fairly active in my Discord, but I'd like to be more active if I could be. Like if more people were in there more often. Um, and yeah, it's just a sort of nice place to hang out and talk about the channel, talk about various things. And a lot of people don't know I have a Discord, so it'd be nice for people to join if you haven't already. Um, oh, such a good item. Um, so yeah, it'd definitely be pretty nice if people joined. I'd definitely be down to see more people in there. And then as well, like, I I'll be honest, I'm not a great Discord server owner in terms of, like, managing it. So if people, like want to give me advice or help based on the other servers they're in for stuff that I could do to improve it, feel free, because I would, I would definitely welcome it. I would definitely welcome it. Uh, anyways, pretty good first floor so far. Pretty good first floor. Um, I am going to go for this real quick and see. Really? That's a bit of an oof. And I, I don't know what I'm going to go for here. I guess I'll try and do Mega Satan for the uh, Golden Trinket unlock. I think it's Golden Trinkets. Oh, wait a minute. I've I've goofed up here. I'm going to say I need the soul hearts before anything else to make sure that I can uh, try and keep my devil deal alive. But yeah, I, I think I'm going to try and do Mega Satan if I can for the golden trinket unlock, but God knows if that'll end up working out. Really, you lock down one of the tiny baby spiders. Right, d dive towards me over this way, my good lad. Or at least walk your way over here. Go. Everything is dying. And then we got one more of you just here. I'm going to go in here first. Oh, I actually got a key from that anyways. Right, let me just quickly take a little look here. Um, We only get two of these. How to jump won't let us jump over. The uh, Hedonist's book thing is real goddamn good, so we'll definitely take that. You could get off the book, please. That'd be great. Um, and then the other thing we want is probably just Monster Manuel. Just because we get to use it once and it actually be valuable. And yeah, if, we, if you want to see what the book does, causes all enemies the lowest HP in the room to explode into a shower of projectiles. It's ace. It's so goddamn good and it's such a low charge rate for it as well. It's basically just use it whenever it's available and it's going to kill a lot of enemies. That was close. It's going to kill a lot of enemies and do some good stuff for us. Very, very nice. Good, good. 
always wary of our friend when it's thin rooms like this. M my biggest issue is going to be not using Anima Solar properly to, to manage him. I, I kind of tend to not really use Anima Solar all that much when I realize that I, I obviously should use it a lot more than I do. Because I, I tend to use it basically mainly for just the combat reasons, and that's kind of it. I don't really use it correctly, as it were. Morbid Heart there is rather nice. Good. Another key is nice. Pop in here. Pop that real quick. Not quite sure what other enemies I've got left in here. They're not so bad. Well, that works out really nicely. Good, good, good. Quickly pop through here. You see what I mean? It's just absolutely an incredibly good uh, space bar. I will take this. It's a little bit of a risk. Um, half soul heart makes me feel better. I'll probably lose a, a red heart out of this. I gained a lot of good stuff there, actually. I did lose some fire rate, but I'm, I'll be honest, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with a slight loss in fire rate. Because we have um, nail polish, which alleviates most of that concern. Oh, really? Oh, really? Double whammy. He not only didn't get hit, he appeared where he already was, so he would have got hit had I just not moved him. The double whammy. Now, one thing we be really good is getting, like, um, 9 volt, is it? That makes, um, oh, dude, this guy's a tricky bastard. He's, he's dodging, he's dipping, duck diving, out of the way. Bad hit there, but it's fine. Okay, nice. Booster pack isn't amazing for us, but we'll check it out. We got three random hearts. We'll just pop that over here. Sadly, all red hearts. We got magician. Lose all of your keys. Spawn proportional number of pickups. No, thank you. We got... Eh, nothing really great there. And of course, like I said, we're going to do angel deal here. We do need a bomb if we're going to do our angel deal, though. So try to remember that, because I will forget. Ooh, this is an annoying ass enemy to be a champion right now. Oh wow, he did drop a did drop a very good tree um thing either, but <laughs> not that it matters because it gave us one coin, the lowest possible roll. Continuum, do not mind at all. Do not mind at all. Unfortunately, if the enemies are champions, they don't have the same level of health, so it doesn't work on champions. But that's kind of fair. He's got probably going to pop up in this next room here, I'd imagine. Go. Here come that boy. Ah, bugger. I kind of had to move out the way there because he was going to jump on me. I really don't like the layout of this room for having um, Chiboy working alongside us here. It doesn't, doesn't help. Some extra bits here and there. Don't think I'm really bothered for that. Anything that's going to make me have to stay in rooms longer is probably not a great idea. Shop is potentially viable here. Again, would very much like a bomb. Look at that. It's just beautiful. And the fact that it explodes him into projectiles as well is just even better. Like, it has no need to do that, and it still does. It's, it's amazing. So don't use the bomb there, even though it's tempting. That was a really bad hit. Like, Anima Solar here is just a no-brainer. I'm just not Anima Solaring him for... for no reason, really. Same with here. Beautiful. I don't think he can actually hit you while he's out of a soul either, which is kind of nice. Oh, this guy's a golden champion. They're rare. They do be rare. Didn't really do much, but they do be rare. Checking here. Ooh, car battery is pretty darn good. Um, I don't think it does a ton with uh, Anima Solar, but it's just good in general. And actually, actually, to be fair, I don't know if it does a ton with our active either. Oh, wait, no. Hmm. It might be really good, actually. Thinking about it now. Oh, bugger. My bad. Okay, so I've definitely ballsed up here. Um, I knew it would happen eventually. We just got to get out of this floor now.
Oh, wait. It actually it actually did work there. Although now it didn't unleash him, which I'm slightly salty about. I, I might die to this guy, I'll be honest. Just because having our friend about here is really wigging me out. Okay, it, Anima Soul works now. Before, it just used to put two chains on the same guy, and it was really stupid. It doesn't seem to do that anymore. How did I not get hit there? Okay, got him. Damn it, are you kidding me? Now I'm going to have to fight the angel without getting hit at all, which seems horrible. Okay, I'm sorry, but this is not at all the floor or room to do this. I, I very much do want to um, do Mega Satan, but there is no way I'd survive that. There is no way, not with the purple fires in there as well. But Anima Solar actually works with their car battery now, which it never used to. It used to just put two chains on, um, on Izao. Now it actually puts one on enemy and one on this. Also, my book, I need to see, does it affect two different types of enemies now? Oh, we got the Steven floor, hello. His text still isn't working, but we got the Steven floor, so we can uh, work that out if we want. Oh my god, I'm pretty sure it's working on two sets of enemies now. That's ludicrously good. <laughs> that is ludicrously good. Oh my god. If we can get 9 volt with this, this is going to be like the most amazing run ever. My bad on that hit. Got some money there, lovely. Yeah, the fact that it chains an enemy and him is pretty darn awesome. Ooh, and it only unchains him when I uh, do that as well, nice. Okay, okay, okay. Good stuff going on with this run right now, which does not bird well for me in total, because I could so easily whiff this now. Oh no, it only uncha it only unchains the one I'm closest to by the looks of it. Dude, I got hit again. Ah, the real bummer. It's a real bummer. <laughs> Oh my god, no Holy Mantle as this guy either, so things could come crashing down very, very quickly, of course. Just kind of is what it is. Everything cleared in that room. Didn't mean to use my bomb there. I used it and immediately regretted it. It's not even a good bomb either. God damn it. Now if I get an angel deal, I don't have a bomb for it. Ooh, um... Not... Not an item I want without permanent flight. Right now it's great, but I don't have permanent flight, so... Although the damage there would be very, very nice. Not good. Not good at all. There's a bomb back, good. Okay. Oh, dude, the fact that it only unchains the one that's closest to me is a real problem. Also, I do not remember how this boss works really at all, so... Forgive me if I die to him. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Got a devil deal, kind of annoying. That's real good. Devil deal, I do not care for you. Right, down to the Steven floor we go. Overall, pretty good run that I'm, I'm totally whiffing. Or potentially totally whiffing. Dude, open your gob and let me in, please.
Why doesn't he open sometimes? What's, what's, what's with this? Last time I just had to wait. Yeah, there you go. We are through. Oh, you want stem cells? Hell yeah. And you give me an active item. And one that's not very good at that. That really rubbed me the wrong way, I gotta say. Should not be able to do that. Here come that boy. Oh, dude. That charger kind of caught me off guard there. I love the insta-clear rooms. You want Seraphim? Hell no. You want Magic 8-Ball? Hell yes. And you give me... When you take damage, emit a shout that hurts. Um, grants an increasing damage boost to lower total health. Yeah, that sounds decent at least. And apparently I can bomb these to change their role, but change their item, but it's a 33% chance and there's a chance that they die also, so it's not guaranteed at all. Ow. I'm kind of annoyed that car battery works the way it does, you know. It's like, in a way it's good, but in a way it's kind of awful, because now I can't use Anima Solar the way I normally would. Like, it releases the wrong enemy first. I wish it would always release him first, not the one that's closest to me. Which I, I kind of get, but it's still annoying. I only affects enemies that are on our screen, I think. A lot going on right now that I can't really understand. I need more bombs. Still only 1660 on the angel chance, which is annoying again. Dude, I've taken so much damage on this floor. I should probably just take that, right? Why not? Oh, dude, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, fuck me. I forgot they could do that. God damn, taking too much damage with this boy. Car battery. Honestly, it, it might not be. A oh, dude. Okay, that thing shoots. Didn't know that. Might not be a bad idea to get rid of car battery, but I, I don't want to. I like it too much, but even though it's causing me problems. Oh, dude. I just can't not get hit right now. This floor is brutal. Let me go fill up my uh, my heart again. I didn't realize those burn things hit me either. I can't even go to the secret room because the game's not giving me enough bombs to do anything. So I wanted to open that chest and the game was like, nah. Secret rooms everywhere and I can't go to any of them. Yeah, that was good damage. Still absolutely adore the music in this section. Ooh, the encroaching darkness is uh, upon me. I don't even know. Like, what the fuck am I meant to do here? <laughs> There's so much going on. This encroaching darkness, does it hurt me? I'm gonna guess it hurts me. But it's taking up so much of my screen space right now. Like, all I'm doing is fighting the minions. I'm not fighting him. Dude, this darkness just will not bugger off. Stop spawning minions! Stop spawning more darkness. This is just impossible to manage and avoid. This boss is so much. Okay, we, we did it. Somehow we did it.
That was that was kind of crazy though. I'm just gonna go to the next floor. I, I I know that the stuff we missed on this floor, but for one, I need my bomb. For two, I just can't I can't even keep an eye on what's going on. Um, right, one sec. Right, let's keep it moving. Oh, the satisfaction. There is satisfaction to be had today. Ow. At the minute, I'm just in the mode of clear as much of the goddamn game as I can before he spawns, and then deal with everything after that. Why is this active so goddamn good? Ooh, I got a planetarium, because apparently I skipped an item room at some point. Huzzah, huzzah. And it is... Um... Ooh, actually, this is pretty good. The sun is also quite nice. Finally got an additional bomb, so I can do that. Little nubbins, please die. Dude, what a what a jerk of a secret room right there. Come on now. What does this one do again? Blood void machine. I don't want to bother with that right now. Dude, this thing with car battery is nutty good. Right. First of all, we can do this. What do you do again? Okay, no, you just killed those things. I didn't, that's not what I wanted to happen, but oh well. Um, this is depth two, so we don't want to go for the boss yet. Angel chance is only 33, so don't know if we're going to get to do Mega Satan. We'll see, I guess. What the hell? Um... This is a good room, but kind of treacherous. Like, kind of really treacherous. Hmm. I don't really know what to do with this room, I'm going to be honest. you got to be kidding me. I still got hit. I still got hit. God damn it. Of course not what I wanted. My goodness. Dude, really? Let's at least pair throw. Dude, really? At least we get Bookworm out of this, but this game, man. I didn't actually need to do that, I just realised. I could have cheesed it, but eh. It is what it is. Right, give me 9 volt, please. Um, Another active. Great. Um, Eternal Heart, thank you. Right, at this rate, I might just do the Beast. And we'll see what we can manage. We will see what we can manage. Not looking good though, is it? Not looking good. But I shall try. I shall try to prevail. Oh, dude, I used the wrong thing then. I meant to use Anima Solar. Of course you got the fly there. Dude, I got hit. And I killed Mum as well. Ah, oh, whatever. That was a good attempt. 
short episode, I know, but it's a hard character. Give me a break. Either way, I hope you guys did enjoy nonetheless, and I'll see you guys in the next one.